she was so excited about the surgery, thinking that it's going to be a magical cut and she will be all good. But it, it took a lot of effort from her to get what she is today. Be strong. The parents of five-year-old Bumi Manjanatha give her kisses of encouragement as she prepares to undergo a rare spinal surgery called selective dorsal rhizotomy at Nationwide Children's Hospital. This is most commonly performed for cerebral palsy. The surgery will make Bumi's muscles less stiff by cutting the nerve roots in the spinal cord that are sending abnormal signals to her muscles. There is improvement in pain and there is a decrease in the amount of orthopedic procedures that they need. Those first few days, that one week when she uh, had to go through that pain, the back pain, the leg pain, it was a, a difficult surgery to go through. She came to rehab really weak, not able to do a lot and move around a lot on her own. Now she's pulling herself up to stand and she's walking with someone watching her with a walker. The parents sort of look at me funny when I say, my part's actually kind of easy. The children have over six months of hard work to do in their physical therapy. Boomy, you're here. Hi. How are you? Now, three months after surgery, Boomy's outpatient therapists say she's improving in every area. She's walking really independently. Her legs are pretty straight. I could really feel her knee locking, which was never there. It is so important because that's what helps her keep up straight and helps her use her upper muscles. Boomi just has an internal drive to do well and to work hard. Now we're seeing the benefit of all that hard work. It looks amazing. It really does. At Nationwide Children's Hospital, I'm Nikki Chave.